Adam and Jamie are rapidly realizing that the concept of man running on water is every bit as improbable as it sounds. <sighs> running on top of the water is totally possible. If you're a bug, something tiny like a water strider is small enough and light enough to rely on the surface tension of the water to stay on top of it. As we get larger, though, things like Jesus lizards have to run really hard to be able to do that. And as we get larger still, something like waterfowl, like a duck, uh, they can run on top of the water too, but they need help. They use their wings. Adam built two fancy lizard feet and a Godzilla tail. All he managed to do was to half drown an acrobat. I can't say that my rig was a success. I mean, we definitely did not see the human lizard hybrid skipping across the water that I had dreamed about. But Jamie has dreams of his own, and Jessica's job is to make them come true. So what do you call these, shovel shoes? Shovel shoes they are. Kind of has a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Yep. True to form, Jessica's okay. soon up and flapping. How about trying to do a little run? It seems like she's found her inner lizard. There you go. It's just what the Jesus lizard does. Whatever, you know, just, just flail at it. Now let's go back down to the water. But any purchase of Jamie's shovel shoes comes with a free gift, a kind of outrigger walking frame that adds balance, much like a tail does, but up front. While a tail may provide a certain amount of stability, I figure that we can do the same thing in the front with the ski, but with the ski, we'll also get a certain amount of supporting lift on the water. Jamie's also relying on a bigger surface area to help keep Jess afloat, but Adam's shoes were flat, and these concave feet could make a real difference. On the other hand, the ski's too cumbersome to carry, so she won't get much of a run-up. Okay, shovel shoes in three, two, one, go. <laughs> okay, that was just embarrassing. So maybe the ski should go the way of the tail. All right, shovel shoes without the sled. In three, two, one, go! Hey! <laughs> She's a good sport. Uh-huh. <laughs> we could try this a hundred times, and I don't think we'd get running on water. No, I don't think we would.